got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. Man, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. A few seconds of searching and we'll know if he has the keys. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. Hurry.
time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up round right back! Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly-dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. All right, that door's not locked anymore. Shit! You three, get on it! I'll get back as fast as I can! Stay away from the windows. Hey, Lee. If we don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. We will make it through this! Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know... I should know what? Huh? You said I should know that. On it. Are you sure? Shit. Oh shit! Okay then. Give it time. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Give it time. Did you find anything? Nothing. Wait! A window with screws! Go! I found something! I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Once again, Savannah is now a stage nine catastrophe. 
Find your friends and be safe. Thanks, Lee. That means a lot. I don't mean to abandon you all, but this seems like an okay setup. And I'm sure things will be back to normal around here in no time. Let's hope. You guys be safe. We'll try. Hey, Kim. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. I think you know what you're doing. Shit, man, do any of us? With Clementine, I mean. Earlier, you said you were clueless. I just want you to know that I look at you and I see the type of guy who figures things out. That girl's gonna be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. You got it. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Well, I'm sure he liked you too. <laughs> he better have. Anyway... I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I was gonna help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. was toast but you know what he wasn't oh and then hey duck uh you want to cool it for a minute okay sorry i'm sorry there's uh, not a lot of kids here no it's not that it's i got grabbed again i was there though i fell and my walkie-talkie broke glenn had the other one oh i'm sorry <laughs> 